Hello, my name is Becca Down and I'm a Prima Senior Director with Ruby Ribbon and I get women out of their underwire bras for a living. So I'm gonna stop for a second and I'm gonna to talk to you about breast health. It's one of my most, my biggest reasons why I do this business. And I've got four tips and I'm gonna first start by talking to you about lymph, our lymph system. So our lymph is throughout the entire body. All of us have it. And it's really more of a stickier fluid and we wanna keep it really fluid. We want to keep it moving. We don't want it to stagnate. Okay. Um, and we have 75% of our lymph is in our breast tissues and also underneath the arms. And if we end up thinking my number one tip has to do with toxins, um, and really looking at your deodorant and making sure that it doesn't have a lot of chemicals in it. And you really want to stay away from al al um, aluminum, excuse me, um, because it's a heavy metal. We don't want that in our bodies and our liver and everything else is doing what it's got to do to get that out of our body. So if you can keep aluminum out of your deodorant, that's awesome. Mine here is paraben free as well. The more chemicals we can keep out of our body, even in our foods, um, really, really important because our liver is doing a lot of work. Our lymph is doing, we put that deodorant underneath our arms and we're stopping the perspiration that is going to get those toxins out of our body. So number one is that. Number two is sugars, diet sodas. A lot of um, foods that actually, when they take away fat, they put in sugar. And you don't wanna end up having a ton of sugar in your diet. Um, and you might wanna end up having less sugar overall, even if it is not artificial, because cancers feed on sugar. So number two tip is sugars in your diet. Number three is moving that lymph system around. So this is what you call a dry brush. I have it in my shower all the time. And you want to like actually brush your breast up, around, underneath, maybe even underneath your underarms and get that lymph moving. Um, part of this too is fluffing the girls. I do this on a regular basis. Um, it is called, it's P-H-L-U-F-F-I-N-G. If you go ahead and search for it, you're gonna find some information. And I will post a video about a nurse who talks about fluffing the girls and also thermography. But some of the benefits of fluffing the girls are it softens the breast, relieves breast pain, prepares girls for um, mammograms, it decreases lumps and cysts in fibrous to stick breasts, it moves the lymphs and it brings killer T cells to protect the breast from bacteria and also cancer. It brings oxygen and blood to the breast tissues cleans out toxins, remember what I was talking about before, and stagnation. It reduces breast tenderness during pregnancy, or overall on that monthly time. Um, and you're gonna become really familiar with your breast tissues, which is really important. But fluffing the girls, and I'll post that video that this nurse did, but it really is about bending over and moving that breast up and down to get that, that fluid moving or that lint moving. And then also tapping the breast together. In that video, the nurse talks about somebody who's smaller breasted and also larger breasted, different techniques, so you can learn about fluffing the girls. So number three tip is dry brushing, moving that length, and fluffing. My number fourth tip is getting out of your underwire bra. So if we end up thinking about um, sports bras, actually smashing the breast tissues, that is really impeding the lymph system, right? We also have the underwire that's going underneath our breasts and it is putting pressure right underneath the underarm where our lymph system, where our lymph nodes are, and it's actually acting like a brace underneath our bust. Again, impeding the lymph system. We want to end up wearing something that doesn't impede it. So we have ruby ribbon camis and our half sister, which is a demiette that you can wear that will actually shape you, mold you, support you, not giving you the uni boob. And these cups are fantastic because they move with you, they stretch. And I have another video where I can show you how that is happening. We have different compression systems in the back. So you can see that this one has an upper back compression and it's variable compression. So that means that it is not um, gonna give us that sausage casing feeling. So I'll show you the patented seams, which are so fantastic. 
and it also has a gripper edge at the bottom so it heat seals to your body and won't move. So it's gonna be able to, you're gonna do yoga in this, you can move with this um, and get into a bigger size if you want more of a gentle and more fluid. And if you wanna go out on that date night, you wanna go ahead and get into a smaller size. This also, this one has a compression in the system in the back that's a little bit longer, finishing off the waist and um, if you have love handles or not. But again, this breast is not gonna actually impede that lymph system here. You can see the structure underneath the bust. Um, this particular one will give you a great amount of support, but it stops at the side so we can get a really smoothing line. So number one, watch your deodorants, get rid of all toxins. Number two, more toxins, getting rid of sugar, and that will, that will feed cancers. Number three, what was it? Dry brushing and moving that lymph system around with fluffing the girls and also your dry brush. And number four, getting out of your underwire by using something like this. If you haven't filled out my form, go ahead and do that and I will help you get a personalized fit. Talk to you soon, bye-bye.